Once upon a time, there lived a little baby in her mother's womb. She was quite content in her cozy home and felt safe and loved. The little baby, content, safe and loved, felt secure in her warm, cozy home inside her mother's womb. One day, the baby heard a voice coming from outside her home. It was her grandmother telling her a magical story that she had never heard before. The grandmother's voice was kind and gentle as she began to tell the story of a brave young child named Isabel who lived in a faraway land called the Kingdom of Wonders. Isabel was adventurous and brave and longed for new adventures every day. One day, she decided to take a trip to the mysterious forest nearby where no one had ever gone before. As soon as Isabel stepped foot into the forest, she encountered magical creatures such as talking rabbits, dancing fairies, and singing birds who welcomed her with open arms. She explored the forest all day long, making friends with every creature she encountered along the way. As night fell, Isabel was surrounded by twinkling stars and fireflies that glowed like tiny candles in the dark night sky above her head. She noticed something special about this place. It seemed to have its own type of magic that filled her with peace and joy wherever she went. Suddenly, Isabel heard a loud roar from nearby. It was an enormous dragon. But instead of scaring Isabel away, he welcomed her warmly with open wings and offered to be her loyal friend forevermore. With the dragon's help, they flew up high into the night sky together until they reached an incredible castle made of candy canes and rainbow-colored lollipops. They explored every corner of this amazing palace until eventually, they found themselves in front of an enormous door with two giant stone lions guarding it. The dragon used his mighty roar to make them come alive so they opened their eyes wide open and let Isabel pass through their door into a wondrous room filled with toys from around the world. The baby nestled deep within her mother's belly became so entranced by this story that when grandmother finished speaking she dreamed of flying away on a happy dragon just like Isabel did, until morning came at last when she returned safely back home again just like nothing ever happened at all. Except now she had many wonderful memories that would stay with her forevermore.